Jumbo fellow dreamers, in today's video I am sharing with you how I make delicious and nutritious homemade gummy bears. Let's go hit it. So for this recipe you're going to need a half of a cup of juice. I'm actually making two recipes. I'm going to do one that's orange and one that is lime. And then you'll need a tablespoon and a half of unflavored gelatin. This is my favorite gelatin. If you're vegan, agar agar would work just fine as well. And then you'll need a tablespoon or two of sweetener, depending on how sweet you want your gummies. So maple syrup, honey, sugar. And then if you want a little extra zing to your gummies, I actually like adding a drop or two of the Young Living Vitality citrus oils, but that's totally optional. So first you're going to want to get a half of a cup of juice. Now for this, um, it took me two and a half limes and three quarters of a large orange. If you have juice that's pre-made in the refrigerator, that's absolutely fine. Cherry juice, pomegranate juice, whatever you happen to have, even lemon juice would be really good as well, depending on how, you know, what flavor you want your gummies to be. So just getting all of my juice squeezed out here, and you can see how pretty that orange color is. It's just so nice. And then here is the lime juice as well. So I'm just gonna take one of my juices, I'm gonna start with the lime one, and put it into a pan that's on medium heat. And I'm going to add about a tablespoon and a half-ish of maple syrup, and a tablespoon and a half of the unflavored gelatin. I'm just going to add that to my pot as well. And this is where a whisk comes in handy because this can tend to stick to the side of the pan. So you really, really wanna mix it very, very well. Um, you'll probably be mixing it for a solid minute or so. Now what you're looking for is for the liquid to kind of become an opaque sort of color and uh, it should get slightly bubbly on top. And you don't want to scorch it, you don't want it boiling over, just kind of keep an eye on it, medium heat, about a minute is pretty much all it takes. So then once that's done, if you want to add your Vitality oils, you can. I meant to put one drop of lime and two came out, but that's okay. It's very limey and delicious. So then I'm just going to pour it into my little jelly gummy molds here. These were from the dollar spot at Target uh, probably about five years ago or so. Um, but you can get these off of Amazon. They actually have really cute ones now where you have little gummy worms, gummy bears, all sorts of different shapes. So explore Amazon. So once they're filled into the jelly mold, you just want to let it sit. I'm going to do the same thing for my orange here as well. You can let it sit on the counter to cool if you want to do that. Or if you're impatient like I am, you can put it in the refrigerator for about a half hour. If you're even more impatient, you can put it in the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes just until they are solid. And then you just pop them out and that is it. Super easy to make healthy gummies that seriously the entire family will love. Just store them in the fridge and snack on them throughout the week. Ours only last a couple of days. Um, because they are just so delicious. Thank you guys so, so much for hanging out with me today. If you haven't already and you'd like to, hit that button down below, subscribe so you never miss a Daily Dreamland video. Kiss someone you love today, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Ciao.